was the exciting part, Valerina. At last, Little John struck like a flash and fracked the tanner met the blow and turned it aside and smote back at Little John, who also turned the blow. And so this mighty battle began. Excuse me, then, then I have to bow back and forth and drop the blow, playing so thick and fast, one was about from a distance, a happy storm in the land. I said, excuse me, thus they fought for nine. Half an hour until the ground was all plowed up from the digging of their fields and their breath was labored like the ox in, in the world. I like oh. some help, please. Oh, no problem. You want some help? Then I'm going to help you. Just as soon as I get my book. Welcome to, Welcome to a life before you. I'm here to buy a book for my son, Timmy. Oh, how exciting! What kind of book we got, Timmy? Timmy. Timmy, he's asking you a question. I hate books. Oh, sure, you don't need that. Don't you care what we have all Timmy doesn't have any books. No books at all? We always meant to buy him one, but we could never make up a commitment. Yes, but I'm sure I can find something to like. We wouldn't be here at all, except the teachers made me want to hold this one. Oh, how exciting! How about a mystery or science fiction? I bet you love our animal story! I don't know why he has to write a book anymore. I mean, books are so old fashioned. Oh, but they're not. Uh, books fuel your imagination, they strengthen your vocabulary. They teach you about other times and other cultures. What do you mean? Well, take this book, for example, Robin Hood. It's about these highway robbers in medieval England. Oh, no. We would never let Timmy read something like that. We're very careful what we expose him to. <coughs> okay, how about this one? White Fang by Jack London. What's that? A book about the teachers? Oh. Oh no! It's about this dog named White Fantasy, and he lives in the Yukon, and he gets sold to this Indian named Great Beaver. And only because he's part rock wool, he gets sold, he gets um, into this fight with a dog named Cherokee. And they pounce at each other, slashing and fighting, tearing and clawing, until White Fang manages to close his jaws around the White Fang's throat. White Fang tries to shake him off, but he doesn't have the strength and he stumbles to the ground, exhausted. Sounds violent. Damn it! Oh, no, really, trust me, it's a very good thing. How much is it? Oh, uh, $50. I don't know, that seems like an awful lot of money. Would you buy it for $2? Come on, Tim, let's see what they have at the library. No, please, just take it. Sure, why not? I guess if you don't like it, you can always sell it. Yay, another 5,000 points! <laughs> don't look at me like the whole room over here. I can't imagine you're trying to open the book! Oh well, I'm going to go to the shop. Does it look like we're, like we're going to get any more customers tonight? So, are you going to stay down here? Is that your room or are you going to come upstairs with us? I don't know. I'm going to go to the shop. Smart skins. You don't let them. The whole world is spinning. What's the matter now, man? Did you cut your tree again? No. Mr. Melvin, do my book again. Ah, uh, good. It's the land of the Nassau Vanda. Be quiet, Toto. You've got to be quiet. You're going to wake up Barbara de 
open. She hasn't gotten to that part yet. A lemonade stand? Oh, no, 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 no. That is simply out of question. Do you know the two rules I laid out for you when I gave you the gift of life? Yes, yes. good fairy. Well, maybe we should go over it one more time. Not so big, big mouth. Can anyone tell me the first rule? Oh, oh, me, 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 yes, me, me, me. Rule number one, never leave the bookstore. Well, it's never leave the building, but you can go upstairs, so it's very territory. Good to know, book fairy. And the second one? Me, me, me. Anyone me. else? Do you have your phones? Rule number two, we must never permit ourselves to be seen or in any other way perceived by human beings. A little wordy, but yes. Those are so dumb. That's why. Why can't we follow you? Why don't we follow you? That's right, honey. You guys have to realize, I went out on a limb for all of you. Book characters are supposed to come to life the noble way, by being read. But when I found out that that wasn't happening here, I decided to step in. Yes, but Perry, I'm so very grateful. But can't you make an exception just as once? Absolutely not. Can you imagine the chaos it would cause if humans saw you fooling around? No. I must insist. If you break either of my two rules, you'll be you'll disappear to your book forever. Mm -hmm. And how is that supposed to work? I I don't know, but it won't be good. Now, excuse me, I must go look for Scarlet O'Hare. No, what's wrong? Oh no, what happened to her? How did you hurt? She's gone with the wind. This is loss. I mean, this is matter that foul feline stole my hat. Shoes. Let's go. Because we're 
We spoke at the villain yet. Lad? Sir Lad, she's fallen off to the fierce. Very good. Good news. Hands by me. I can't say for certain. 
do. But I do know one thing. This necklace was stolen. Oh, what clue did you have? Did you find a suspicious hair inside the carpet? Or a finger from Auntie Class? No, no, I saw a story about it on the news. Class, if the Brook brothers get caught with a stolen necklace, they'll be thrown to run into jail for sure. What should we do? I don't know, maybe you could write a note. Time. Step one, a lady rent 
steals the necklace. Step two, she puts the necklace in a book. She sells the book to a used bookstore. She buys the book and gets it to the mall. That's a, that's a lot of steps. Put the mom in protection. We don't want the baby man to know, know who he is just in case she gets caught. Oh, okay. Hey, wait a minute. What if we get caught? Who cares? We ain't doing nothing illegal. Just buy the book. Hmm. Well, the show you just buy the books you brought me How are we supposed to know which one is the jewels? <coughs> the box is always incredible. It's having to repeat over and over and over again trying to remember it. Oh, really? What's the title? I forget, but I know it has a lot on it. This might have some jewels in it. What does it have lock on it? No. Then no. That ain't it.
exactly what I say. Dear family and mommy, we do not wish to alarm you. Are you crazy? Of course we wish to alarm them. That's the whole point of the dog. Dear Mark and Melvin, we wish to alarm you. As there are a pair of scope laws. The word is for me. God bless. We shall return tomorrow for a dining and stay in this place. I'm sorry. Lost. The only God has been made of you a grievous affliction. Great injury. Do you want to go? I think so. <coughs> Very good. I'll leave it there on the counter. Now that I'm here, I'm certain to see you in the morning. I'd say that was rather a little bit, wouldn't you? Well, it's not as gripping as an Arthur Conan Doyle story, but it'll do. Two? We don't care too well. Feel me, fingers. Oh.
what, what set her down in this bracket? Doctor, it's killing me! Oh, I don't know. Maybe she's playing out to get out to the park. Hey, Joe, what's this? It's the 
No wonder they didn't know those two thieves were coming. They never got the letter to go straight. Yeah. And the necklaces here that I can see either. Yeah. 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 Maybe let's keep spreading. Oh, we have to keep it. Maybe we must. Oh, you have to keep looking for it. sense at all. Yeah. We'll see about that. Fingers. 
You know what to do. Pick them up. What? How about Marie Hoffman? No! No, please don't hurt my books! No! no. no. Are you guys out for the real deficit now? We already told you. Never had it! Pick another book. No! This one's got a funny name. Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! No! No! Are you going to tell Gerdes now? How many times do I have to get into your head? We don't have it! Pick another book. Ooh, 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 I know this one. Heidi! All too familiar, folks. Who are you? Who are you? I'm only drinking out on the light. Necklace, all right, but what were you doing with it? Um, we 
me, I was just um, keeping it safe for those two build brats over there. Also, I don't know what he's yapping about. I'm sure you that, that was the, that was the necklace you just smoked. When I say shut up, I mean shut up. I don't understand. This is the necklace from the store. Where'd the other one come from? I'm afraid that's my fault, officer. I thought that if I gave the smuggler with my Aunt Polly necklace, and then go away and leave Harper Bell alone. Oh, yeah, Mom! Yeah. Yeah. See, I always said you can't trust little girls. I'm glad it ain't much better. Hey! All right, you Kurt, I'm running you in. I've got more than enough evidence to book you. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I made a joke. <laughs> I have to go on top of it. Hey, Eddie, Eddie, hear that? Come and made a joke. You know your problem, Fingers. Your mouth keeps on working overtime while your brain is still on break. Thanks, guys. We don't know what we're looking at without you. Hold up. What's wrong? Feels like I got a lasso around my waist. Oh, that's how that works. What do you mean? What? The spell, of course. Now that they were seen, they're going to go into the books forever now. No, please, there's no so much we want to talk to you about. I'm sorry, but the force is too strong. Uh oh. Here I go. Come up here. And then Whitney. Am 
Right, hold on. I had to hide these. <laughs> All right, so Amy George, she is our amazing director that, what, February? <laughs> Stepped in like yeah, a month and a half ago. Yeah, something happened with our old director, and so Amy stepped in in like February, and so she had a very kind of a last minute flung into being the director of the play, and she did an amazing job. Very, very, very extremely um, grateful for all that she did. She worked on blocking endlessly with these children, um, articulation, just working and working. And this past week, we were all here for hours and hours each day, just trying to get everything together. So I just wanted to um, go up with some, uh, some self-care. Thank you. Because after this week, yes. we have <laughs> you had no idea. I got some flowers too. Okay, so Karen, um, um, sh she's just been amazing. Like she has stepped in a lot of the backgrounds that you saw. She's kind of put together. Um, she has been helping with our drama for years and years and her daughter, which is Melissa is going to be graduating the senior, so we're losing Karen. And Pollyanna. Well, like Pollyanna, my daughter, too. She's a senior. But um, at co-op, Karen, like her daughter, only came for drama and only for the second semester, but for the whole year. Karen has been jumping in. She has been subbing. She has been working her tail off um, for our co-op when her daughter was, you know, here for one class. So, I don't know what we're going to do about her. <laughs> and I gave you a little self-care thing, because she has also put in hours trying to help and work with Miss Amy, and just, what do you need? How, what can I do? How can I help you? I have amazing ideas, and the two of these with all their amazing ideas, amazing play. So, thank you very much. <laughs> I don't know if you want to say something, but I know that these kids, you guys, like, you guys were so amazing. This was so good, and it was so funny. <laughs> so many one-liners in here so they had to be clear so that we could pick up on all the jokes and some of them maybe went over their heads but we thought it was funny so yeah. <laughs> we but, some of the lines in the scene where we got raised you know what you guys did you guys to me so we are yeah <laughs> Okay, so we wanted to give parents an opportunity to take pictures of the kids. Um, so we're gonna have them stay up here for a moment and parents are welcome to come up and just get as many shots as you want. And then I'll have them kind of sit, like stand in one of their seats and you can get some other still shots. Does that sound good? And then we can do singles and all of that. All right. So 